<laughs> Hello everybody, welcome to another great episode of Hillbilly Select Reviews. I review these hard ciders, I review beers, wines, every type of liqueur, liquor, teas, my famous Sunday morning coffee review. I even do foods that have these things as ingredients, or any product that has these things as ingredients, alright? These are the drinks that made civilization. This is the stuff that made separates man from the monkey. Right? This is some of our greatest innovations goes into coming up with this stuff. And it goes back thousands and thousands of years. Now, the general principle. <clears throat> that being said, take a moment and subscribe, okay? Because on this end, I'm going to do a lot of stuff for you. A lot of stuff. What are you going to do for me on that end, I hope? Subscribe, if you can. Hit the thumbs up, which everybody can do. Leave a comment, even if it's hello, which everybody can do. And watch to the end, because if you do that part, and I do this part, this will be the greatest channel on YouTube history, and we will all be a part of it. It's exciting. White Claw. Ruby Grapefruit. It's getting to be that time of year. Okay, so, if you like seltzers, hard seltzers, here we go. White Claw. Ruby Grapefruit. Mm, mm, mm. Now, Attached to this video description and the first comment, which will be pinned, is my seltzer playlist. Extensive. Check it out. Pop on it. You'll see all the great seltzer reviews. And while you're at it, check out my playlist because I got things broken down, easy to find. Just amazing stuff that you are going to love. Now, 5% ABV. 100 calories, gluten-free, two carbs. If you know anything about seltzers, you know they generally have a kiss. And I have seltzers made with every kind of liquor. I have seltzers made with tequila, everything else. We won't get into that right now. A kiss of flavor. They are clean. They are crisp. They are low calorie. They have the same alcohol as a beer. Low sugar. There's a place for them. But they're not flavor bombs. Okay. You give Flavor Bomb up for some of the cleanness. Let's get into it. All I want to know is does it taste like Ruby Grapefruit? All right, that's all we want to know. And is it good? I don't want bitter grapefruit. I don't want Ruby Grapefruit. All right, these things are always clear, no matter what the flavor, which is cool because they could color these and, uh, you know, make them match the fruit. But this adds to the cleanness, all right? It's one less thing in there that you don't need. It would look pretty, but we don't need it. All right. Let's give it a smell, like we always do. It's got a nice smell. It does have a nice smell of grapefruit, all right? Home run on the sniff test. Yeah, then it smells like a fresh grapefruit. Not candy, not artificial, not fresh, squee, or you cut a grape, that's what it smells like, so I, I like that. Hmm. It's not sour like a grapefruit can be. It's more like a pink grapefruit. Not sweet, but not like yellow, where it's sour. Nice grapefruit flavor of the pink grapefruit. Thus, the ruby grapefruit. A lot of times I'm not a big fan of grapefruit because of the bitterness at the end, that bitter grapefruit. But this don't have that. This is more like the pink grapefruit. It's got the great grapefruit flavor that we all know and love without that bitterness. This is one of, one of the... One of, I like this. I like this flavor a lot. I'm surprised. I'm not a great big grapefruit fan. But I do enjoy this one. So, from the makers I said of Mike's Hard Lemonade. White Claw. Huh? Might be one of my favorites so far, and I've done a lot. Alright, check out everything. Do your part. I'll do my part, and we'll all be a part of this together. Alright? Cool? <laughs> Thank you. I'll see you on the next one. i got a lot of great stuff coming up.